I travel all over the country getting the opportunity to talk to young players. For all intents and purposes, I have my hand right on the heartbeat of the game. I listen to coaches. I'm thankful to coaches who let me enter their gym to put on clinics. I'm thankful that I get the opportunity to sit down and talk basketball, to talk hoops with the young players of tomorrow. Players today with dreams about tomorrow. Do you let your imagination run wild like I did when I was a player? Are you dumb enough, are you foolish enough to let some player tell you that you can't make it? The only one who can place a limit on yourself is you. You, the basketball player, that's getting ready to play in this game. I know what you're getting ready to do. I know you're going to be alone at times, dreaming about playing in the NBA, dreaming about coming down, knocking down that J at the end of the game. I understand. I've been there. Coaches may say to you, players may say, hey, son, you're not quick enough. You're not fast enough. And you may, like me, you're not going to hear them. Because you and I, we know that you're going to go home and you're going to work a little bit harder. When somebody's down at the pool, you're going to be jumping rope. When somebody maybe is not thinking about doing it, you're going to be out there taking an extra 50, 60 jump shots a day. And maybe 200 jump shots a day. The road to success is always under construction. <laughs> I shoot with a Biden basketball. I wear pony basketball shoes. Two companies that make quality products, but in addition, they spend time and money, and they put this time and this money back into the game of basketball, trying to help young players improve their game. That's the sole purpose of this video. I want to take this basketball, I want to stick it in your chest, and tell you it's your ball out of bounds. I want you to ask yourself, how bad do you want to play? How hard will you work to improve your game? And are you willing to make the commitment? The choice is yours. I want you to set goals for yourself. Whether it's making the grammar school, junior high, high school, or college team, or perhaps one step further, you'll put a dream in your hand just like I did, reaching the top professional basketball. It all comes down to a very strong want-to work commitment. No matter where I go, no matter where I get the opportunity to talk basketball, to me it's an exciting time. As I travel across the country, as I watch high school teams play, 80% of high school basketball today, zone defenses are put up. Zone defenses are put up. Zone defense says, you must shoot the basketball over the top we're going to force you to shoot the basketball over the top. We want to make sure that we can stop the initial entry pass. We're going to police and protect the paint. And if you can't shoot the J and you can't enter the basketball, we will beat you. We will beat you. I talk about defense. Yeah, it's important. It's important. But you've got to make that mighty trip down the court, and you've got to put the ball in the hole. And the good players that can shoot the basketball the good players that can shoot the basketball can extend the defense to create space on the floor. And the basic thing that we're doing right now is going to discuss not how to shoot a basketball, but we're going to discuss the art of shooting. Because see, art of shooting and shooting a basketball, it's a skill. Shooting a basketball is a high-tech skill. When you shoot the ball quickly and when you shoot the ball accurately, you have mastered the four basic steps of shooting a basketball. Here's what I'm going to do for you. I'm going to give you knowledge, because knowledge is what to do. When you put the pill in your hand, what is going to be your view from behind the ball? Knowledge is what to do. That's the number one step in your learning process. Method, I'm going to show you as well as tell you how to do it. 
then you're going to take knowledge and method, and you're going to get over here, and you're going to go through the final test, repetition, and through repetition, you want to get what? You want to get results. Let's talk about it a little bit. Shooting a basketball quickly and accurately takes skill. In order to acquire skill, you have to understand and learn the basics. The purpose of this video is to take the basketball and break it down to four easy steps. Four easy steps that with constant repetition can help make you a better shooter. The first step is bounce.